Pacific has some of the world's highest rate of domestic violence. On average, two out of three Pacific Island women will experience domestic violence at some point in their lifetime. These women are more likely to experience more severe forms of such violence. This is more than twice the global average. It is a significant problem in the Pacific as well as the world and one that governments are not taking lightly. The delegation led by the Director for Women of Tonga are here on the fact-finding mission to explore options and models of services delivery for referrals, for family and domestic violence cases. Gather ideas and exchange insight with their Fijian counterparts about services delivery models and referrals for responding to case of gender-based. On this uh, study tour to share and also to learn the processes that they go through to, uh, uh, to help the survivors of, of domestic violence. The purpose of the study tour is to explore options and models of service delivery for referrals for family and are transferable on which warrant consideration for adoption to the Tongan context. Our um, goal of this program is just um, helping agency strengthening what is already in place in, um, and the main goal is uh, providing uh, uh, safety or as our uh, the logo says, families that are free of violence. Bringing the two countries together only add values to the program. To support South-South learning between Tonga and Fiji on how to strengthen and improve services for women and girls who experience violence. Um, across the Pacific, countries are in different places in terms of the, the tools, the protocols, the systems that they have developed to help women and girls who experience violence get the help that they need and to make sure that the police, health, social services, crisis centers, justice actors are working really well together so that we can make sure that women and girls don't get dropped along the services that they need, that there's a nice continuum of care and everyone is working together. The role of UN Women is to support national government and frontline services provider for women, girls and families who experience violence. To meet with the different providers, for the governments to speak directly to one another on how they are overseeing and managing um, frontline service providers to have the best service for women and girls. So we're really excited that for this visit, we see Tonga coming to Fiji to see how Fiji has moved forward their services, but also Fiji has the opportunity in this meeting to learn as well from the Tongan context and what they are doing um, to improve access to service. This visit is an important one for the Tongan delegation. So our role is really through the convening and coordination um, and direct partnership role that we have at national level, but also the regional work that we do in bringing learning partners together is to help facilitate this learning exchange in partnership with the Families Free of Violence program, um, who is funding and sponsoring this trip and who um, works very closely with all of the stakeholders in Tonga um, to improve services. So what is the group hoping to get out of this fact-finding mission? So to let the group um, you know, engage, find out what's happening so that when the group goes back to Tonga, they'll have identified, okay, that would work for Tonga, that won't work for Tonga, so that the Tongans themselves build up their own as to context and also availability of resources and also um, the way we Tongans think. So sometimes it's a little bit different. <laughs> The Tongan delegation will also visit Canberra as part of their fact-finding mission. 